towel, pants, socks, shorts and a t-shirt. And the certain people put on jumpers, tracks at bottoms and rain jackets and they hang them out on their pegs. Frank, Frank sorry, and Matthias Jack, they wear they always wear everything, they don't never wear shorts or anything like they've always got their tracks with bottoms on. And Russell as well, because he ain't it's freezing over here. Enjoy your training. I enjoy doing my weights, running, and, and just general keeping fit. What we look for at, at our club is that they've got to be in for 10 o'clock uh, and ready for 10, and down to the training ground for 10.30. The only problem for us is that we never know where we're training from one day to the next because we don't have a set training ground. We tend to move between um, Musselburgh and Wardy uh, in the summer. Sometimes it's the Royal Academy near the Botanic Garden, so we, uh, you know, it's always interesting to find out where we're going to be from one day to the next. And the players actually implement their own things. With, so they take it upon themselves to do this. And the beauty of that is that, so they're in charge of that. It means that there's no animosity between us and them. And you know they can have a, a wee bit of fun with it as well. They are sitting looking at the clock and seeing who's coming in, and that allows us to get on with the job in hand, getting organised for training, rather than saying, oh, he's one minute late or whatever. There's a list just on the wall over there, and we get three players. You get like two two pros and two and a young pro, and then. You just have to clean their boots for the whole year and hopefully you get a tip at the end. I mean, there's no, there's no set routine in particular, but we just tend to, to work for around an hour and a half. People wonder why you don't train for longer, but the reason is to condition your body to try and be able to be fit for 90 minutes work. I uh, do talent analysis. It's great, great. Gives me a tip every time he scores, so I'm happy. We Russell, oh. in his boots, you know. So, he's always wanting, you know, about five pairs of boots, so it's, it's quite hard to keep up with well, cleaning them, basically. So, gives you a tip at Christmas and the end of the season tip, usually about £100, you know. So, that's all right, it's not too bad. But I want to earn the boys' respect. And the way you do that is the way you go about your business. And if you're a fit 36-year-old boy, then um, I feel that uh, you'll get instant respect from him. Who's worst to clean boots for? Right, so it's a boy. Yeah, right. Has to be perfect. No, no polish on the white bits. He's actually an alright guy, actually. He's actually cleaned them himself a few times as well, which is quite good. I uh, don't know if that was my fault or not, but uh, <laughs> yeah, he's, he's actually a good guy. He's really nice. I heard it's Macintosh, to be honest. He's supposedly pretty hard to do them for, but um, luckily I'm not on him, so I don't have to worry about that. up the back side. I suppose at times, um, in terms of the physical stuff, Russell would love to play football all day and every day, you know. Um, give him a ball and he is one of the best trainers. But when it comes to just pure straightforward running, then he's, you know, he he's, can be hard work, but he puts it in. Well, there's some who don't even bother training. They're that bad. Um, who are they? Well, Sean Dennis, he loves a day off. Um, you know, he, he likes to make a comeback on a Friday to put himself in contention for a match on a Saturday. I would say Dirk Kleeman. I would, honestly. But he's a fit boy. Very lean, very lean. I don't know. Um, training is very important, but um, sometimes it's like probably everybody has to do his job day in, day out. Sometimes you, you, you 
don't bother so much, but um, I'm still be concentrated, you know. But sometimes you have days where I really train badly, and um, and I know for myself, then you know you should you should put probably a little bit more into the training session. And don't forget, um, even in the five sides, we want to win, so you soon get told in no uncertain terms to uh, get his finger out. Like pre-season, I know it's very hard, but I know as well that it's very important for us that we have to um, train well and that we have to prepare us because uh, it's a hard season every year and um, we have to do something, you know, and um, I enjoy it even if we have a running session. I enjoy it, you know, I'm really happy after training can say today it was hard, but you know, I'm, I'm glad that I did it. Into the dressing room. Right, so here we are in the Hibs dressing room. This is the manager's office. This is Big Jim McCafferty. Big Jim, the fit man. And I can just hear. I was just going to go through for you, Oli Gotskowskin, Grant Brebner. He's a new trainer. That's two lovers! Ah! Oh! It's so pretty, they Fuck you! Someone who's going to work for the camera, John Hughes. Yeah! Here we have there, Paul Lovering on the left, with no mask, John Hughes with a mask. They both look the same. Matthias Jack. Paul Lovering, ah. Derek Collins. A quiet dressing room this morning, a nice smile from lovers. First place, have a little look around. Get the case of beer. We want to get, yeah. Derek we want to win this we want Good morning, Dale. We want to finish our target was second or third. Yogi, every chance you'll nick this off me today. Come on. Come on, Closing in on Dirk Lehman, known as the porn star. Dirk, have you done your hair this morning? Okay. The band's favourite, Kenny Miller. The ladies. Paul Hartley, very shy, Mowgli. Here we are, Scott Bannerman. <laughs> Yogi has just given us a Winston Churchill type speech and the lads are absolutely hanging from it. Mixed with Pat Lyman. <laughs> Oli got Skelson, he's leaving us, that's a shame. Grant Bremner, very quiet, very quiet lad. Keeps himself to himself. Donald Park in the corner there. Um, Did a fantastic job with the under 21s this year. Don't talk to me unless you've got something to say to the camera. Nineteen. Two stars. 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 Two stars.